Bible, we're the McLaurin family. And we wanted to share what God's been doing in our lives during this time of isolation. First, we'd like to share some scripture with you from 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verses 3 through 7. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of compassion and the God of all comfort, who comforts us in all our troubles, so that we can comfort those in any trouble with the comfort we ourselves receive from God. For just as we share abundantly in the sufferings of Christ, so also our comfort abounds through Christ. If we are distressed, it is for your comfort and salvation. If we are comforted, it is for your comfort, which produces in you patient endurance of the same sufferings we suffer. And our hope for you is firm, because we know that just as you share in our sufferings, so also you share in our comfort. So for me during this time, it, not a lot has changed from a work perspective. I work from home uh, all the time anyway, but it has mean that I've traveled less and that's been fantastic to have more time with the family. I've also um, enjoyed this time of isolation um, be, for, for extra time with family because I'm usually at school most of the time. I um, I had to have stitches because of an accident that I had, and I, I'm just glad that God has healed me well. Um, God has helped us through our garden, Mr. Tuttle, me, Andrew, Isaac. We've just been working on this garden, and it's been great how it's turned out and how it's coming along. And just always, God has always been beside us and near us for, and thinking about us with what we're doing. Indeed, we are grateful for all the signs of spring. We love seeing the flowers and the we love seeing the weather change. We've gone on lots of walks to enjoy God's creation. So in this time, we ask that you remember that Christ is our comfort that it is him that we can lean into, and we pray that you'll have opportunity to comfort those around you, that you're reaching out to people, that you're staying in contact with your brothers and sisters at Christ Chapel. We love you. We miss you. you.